praise the name of Jesus. Amen. What an awesome God we said. Doing wonders. Amen. Amen. Every time I look this place, I'm amazed. And I said, God, if you have asked me 10, 15 years ago, where are these things, this being to be here, I will tell you no. To see what is unfolding here, because this is just the beginning. I see bigger things happening here. Amen. Amen. I know for many of us, we are looking at the structure and we bless God for this. But for me, as a man of God, I see God raising national leaders out of this place. Yeah. I see God raising people who will touch their world. People who will go beyond the boundaries of Liberia. And to see that God will use, you know, our son, Pastor Abel, his wife, Pastor Joe and the rest of you know the partners, I just can't imagine how it's happening. What we are seeing here today, it must be God. Someone, can you raise your hand and say that we say it must be God? Come on, say it must be God. Hallelujah. So we have come not to waste time, but like he said, to dedicate this historic building. Amen. Oh, it got to be God. Sing that song like you know it is God. It got to be God. It got to be God. It got Sing that song. It got to be God. And you believe that God is going to raise great people out of the place. Yeah. I will want you to shout a victorious amen. Yeah. Today we have come to turn over to God. Yeah. Who initiated this project. Yeah. We believe in our mind that this project was initiated by God. Yeah. And the Bible says in Proverbs chapter 3, in verse 5. He said, in all your undertaking." In everything that you do, acknowledge God. Yes. Then He will direct your path. Yes. Today, we have come to acknowledge God once again in their business. Yes. I told people, David was not the only great king of Israel. David did so many bad things, but God respected David. And God was able to even make covenant with David for generations. What was David's secret? David's secret was that every time God does something, He will always come back to give God the glory. He will always acknowledge God. Yes, Amen. Amen. And he will ascribe all his successes to God. And I think that's a step today. Reverend Abraham, his family, and the rest of the team, including Pastor Joe, are doing here. So as you have come, we want you to join us. In the first place, let us all raise our voices and appreciate God for what he has done. Amen. 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 Let us also tell God thank you that what he has started, we believe it will continue. We are also going to be telling God thank you for the human agents, the instrument that God used him on it to bring the vision to where it is. We are appreciating God for that, especially for our dear father, our friend and brother, Joe. What is Joe for me? Joe Kole? Joe Kole Amara. Let's clap for him. Let's clap for him. Joe, just wave. Pastor Joe, just wave. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Pastor Joe is a great partner to this place. 
So let us begin to appreciate God. Raise your voice and get them. God, thank you for this work. Thank God, thank you for everyone God has used to bring the work to where it is. Father, we give you praise. We give you the glory. We give you the honor. Indeed, I will God, 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 God. Thank you for working with me. Thank you for working with me. Thank you for everyone you have used and everyone you will continue to use. We bless and honor you in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Our Heavenly Father, our faithful God, today we have come to give back unto you that which you have entrusted into our care. As a family, we acknowledge you in this business. We have come to say, God, it is you alone that deserves the glory. As Solomon did, today we have come to say, Father, here is what you started. Today, as we dedicate this school, Father, we pray that there will be no premature death of any of our students. Amen. Father, we pray Amen. that today as we take charge and take ownership of the project for you, the Lady God, we decree and we declare that our staff, our instructors, and their family are protected in the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray that everyone that will enter this building Oh God, they shall be blessed in the name of Jesus. Amen. They shall be blessed in the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray against sickness and diseases. Amen. We pray against misfortune in the name of Jesus. Amen. Today, Father, we take ownership of this project. And we say, God, as of today, as of today, let your name be glorified. Amen. Let your name be praised. Amen. Father, the rest of the things that are needed to complete the work, we thank you that you are provided already. Amen. Father, we give you the glory. Amen. Now, we dedicate this building in the name of God the Father. Shall we say amen? Amen. We anoint this building as a property, not unto men, but for the living God. Amen. The Son. Amen. Shall we say amen? amen? And we dedicate it in the name of God the Father. Shall we say amen? amen? Amen. We take charge of the entrance of this building today amen. as it will be open for use. <coughs> Father, by this anointing, amen. we decree your peace. Amen. By this anointing, amen. we decree that this building and everyone that will be working in here, Amen. it is well with them. Amen. It shall be well with them. Amen. There will be no mooning in this building. Amen. There will be no weeping in this building. Amen. Our children, as they come to school, they will come in peace. Amen. That there will be no accident. Amen. The bosses, as you can see, that will be conveying our children here and there, even including our instructors. We decree today as we dedicate this project, Amen. there will be no accident. Amen. Our instructor will come in peace and go back in peace. Amen. Our children will come in peace and go back in peace. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Now, unto him who is able to keep that which have been entrusted in his gear, to you be glory, to you be honor. We dedicate this in Jesus' mighty name. Let's say the amen. amen. A bigger amen.